Hi. Um, congratulations, you're halfway done. <laughs> uh, you've done three projects which have focused in different ways on the middle section of the design process arrow, um, the design exploration and design optimization. Um, and hopefully you're feeling a lot more comfortable with those than you did at the beginning uh, because now we're going to move on to the first part, problem definition. Instead of um, me giving you the parameters and giving you the instructions and telling you what to do and telling you what has to happen, you're going to be doing that on your own. All I'm giving you is, is uh, a general uh, task, which is to create kinetic art. Uh, kinetic art, you can look it up, but basically it's, it's art that moves either by wind or by touching or um, sometimes I've seen either static electricity setting something off. Uh, the idea is that um, you're kind of opening up the problem to yourself. So what can I build and what can represent me in art form? Or what do I, th I want to make? And um, that's why we're focusing on problem definition this time. And um, the other thing I thought would be nice introducing it this way is uh, you know yourself very well. And so introducing a problem that you have to solve for yourself uh, is a great way to get started. We'll get on to kind of thinking about problem definition for other people in the other in the er, in the remaining tasks. <laughs> um, so, like I said, this is more open and um, have fun with it. And uh, just think about what have you learned so far, and what do you look forward to learning in the second half of the course. Thank you.